Prime Minister Modi came down heavily on Congress over Sam Petroda's comment and the heat got to Nitin Gadkari who fainted during a rally. On the last day of election campaigning of second phase of Lok Sabha elections 2024, let's see what happened in the political arena of the country. Comments by Congress leader Sam Petroda gave Prime Minister Narendra Modi fresh ammunition as he tore into Congress at a rally in Chhattisgarh on Wednesday. The Prime Minister accused the party of planning to burden the middle class with higher taxes. In an interview, Sam Petroda, chairman of Indian Overseas of Congress, said that the inheritance tax in America was an interesting law and could be one of the issues that people could debate and discuss in India. Union Minister Nitin Gadkari on Wednesday fainted while speaking at an election rally in Maharashtra. As he suffered a fainting fit, the security personnel accompanying him carried him off stage. The minister, however, recovered after a few minutes and completed his speech. He explained that due to heat, he fainted but is fine now. While the human-animal conflict is one of the key election issues in several constituencies across Kerala, the situation seems to be grimmer in Rahul Gandhi's battleground, Wayanad, where three people have been trampled to death by wild elephants this year so far. The LDF, Congress and BJP have been blaming each other over this raging crisis which has already displaced many farmer families from their lands abutting forest tracks. Rahul Gandhi during his recent two-day campaign in the region emphasised his commitment to resolving this pressing issue pledging to exert pressure on both state and central governments. However, the CPIM has criticised Rahul Gandhi for what they perceive as a silence on the matter and his failure to advocate for amendments to the Wildlife Protection Act. Meanwhile, the BJP has seized upon this opportunity to target the Congress with BJP nominee K. Surendran, alleging that the Congress manifesto is not aligned with the demands of the people in hilly areas seeking a permanent solution to wild animal attacks. For more updates on Lok Sabha elections 2024 and news across the globe, keep watching the Indian Express.